Hello everyone! Hello! And welcome back to Let's Play Grand Theft Auto 2. I'm back, Shadow. Um, and um, in the last uh, video, folks, um, we uh, have actually completed level 1. Um, although this is currently saying that we did not. Um, and that's because, you know, I sort of loaded the game again, folks. Um, so it's now time, you know, we've done level 1, we did a few, uh, few of the extra ones as well, the ones we had, and I had a, I had a good fun time, that's for sure. Um, so now, folks, it is time to, um, well, get back on with the second level, folks. Um, and we need to load our game. If it comes up, I haven't got anything now, I'm gonna be pissed. Thank you, Shadow Woe! Or Shadow Zero, as was noted. Uh, it is Shadow Zero against one and two. Depending on how many you got, you get the idea, folks. So, anyways, on to the second level. Although, actually, before I start the second level, I might want to actually get my map out. That might be an intelligent thing to do. Anyways, I'll get this loading while I get my map out. It's probably a good idea. But yes, we're off to the residential set. Just load the bloody thing! Ugh. We're off to the uh, the residential zone, folks. Um, the residential sector, to be uh, a bit more precise. Um, good map, this. I, as I said, probably one of my favourites of the lot. This one, great fun. Welcome to the residential district, home to the roughneck, roughneck, redneck gang, the smartass SRS scientists, and of course, the cunning Zaibatsu Corporation. Good luck. Well, folks, we're gonna need that luck. Um, welcome to the residential set. I don't even have any money. Well, now I have some money. Yes, yeah, so you can come here. Um, pistols actually spawn here, which is uh, rather nice of us. Um, if you look at um, the maps, which of course I've got linked. Um, we got um, where are we? We're pretty central in this map, folks. Um, we're right here. Oh, I'll grab that. Um, as you can see, we are right here next to this um, crane. Here, which is pretty decent. Um, and while we're here, actually, we might as well take an opportunity just to, um, well, put the put a car in or two. I'll put in this uh, a, ha a Hachura. Not a bad car, this actually. That is being put in because it's pretty decent. Um, I was just show you. Um, so that will then get out crushed over there. So I've got this but this cut in my mouth, and it really bloody hurts. And that will go up there. Uh, it's a bit fiddly getting to this conveyor belt, folks. What you need to do is you need to come all the way back around here. All the way back around. And then you need to jump over here. And then jump over there. You see what they give you, folks. Rocket launchers. Thank you, God. Highly appreciate that. Do you think God would give a man 15 rocket launchers? I don't know. Um, while we're here, also, we might as well have a crack at, um, if you come down here, we got a, a kill frenzy here. Ten kills with, um, Molotovs. Which is not easy, folks, actually. It takes a bit of practice and, um, in getting used to it. But luckily, I believe it does count for, um, taking out vehicles. Yeah, it does count taking out vehicles. So what you can do is just create a traffic jam. Uh, or at least the explosion um, that it hits gets the kills, but not any adjacent explosions. Get the point? Yeah. But yeah, it's not its not actually easy, this. Although, practicing with these styles of weapons never really hurt at this point. Um, you're going to find yourself using these kind of things more and more often. Uh-oh. Uh, the cop got on the wrong place at the wrong time, but we got an extra life. Which is pretty nice. Though we are a bit hurt. Now, being a new city, obviously, no, um, things are a little bit different. However, the stakes have been raised in regards to our um, our free gangs, folks. Stakes have been really raised. You remember when I was speaking in the last um, last episode, folks? Um, oh, I've got to my time. Uh, the last episode, folks, and when I was talking about the gangs only using pistols that last time. At this point. Rules are different. That if they no, if they if they like you, it is just pistols. But now, if they don't like you, then they will bring out bigger and badder weaponry. Um, here's the uh, the rednecks here, uh, motley little bunch. They're 
they're, uh, they're a pretty cool group. Um, interesting leader. You've got the scientists, and of course, we remember the Zaibotsu. <clears throat> yeah, thanks for that. Uh, and of course, we've got a new, um, with new areas come new radio stations. Um, and the first place we're going to be going to work for, folks, are the Rednecks. Um, and as you saying this, folks, this is not out of um, choice. I highly advise you do the Rednecks first. Let's just see what we come here. If we go up here, um, just there's yellow phones. Grab some supplies. Notice you only get tens of the machine guns, not thirties. Bear that one in mind. But we're going to go to the Rednecks first because I highly, highly advise you go for and work for them first and do all their jobs first. That is the honest truth. You want to do that while I just scratch my arm. Did I just hear... No, maybe not. Oh, this is the um, their, uh, redneck vehicle here, by the way. Uh, they've got um, the... Uh, uh, names escape me, folks. Like RVs, trailers, something like that. Oh, and you yeah, notice there's a GA2 um, sign up there. No, I don't want to hit the rednecks and start getting them hating me immediately. Can I get up there? Hmm. I'm just kind of curious to how you get up there, folks. I know I'm sidetracking a little bit here. But uh, never mind. Oh, yes, and also just note, yeah, target score is now 3 million. Um, you know, and you'll find points aren't going to come, probably aren't going to come as easy because everything is harder now. And you will see what I mean by everything. Things have changed. Um, and where the hell am I? God only knows. Should we get on with the first mission, folks? That might not be the worst of ideas. Though this should prove kind of interesting in this machine gun. And, um, we'll, uh, well, we'll, um, get cracking. We'll just get my save states. Yep, right. Let's get cracking, folks. Hey, Rooster. Bella Bop Bane. <laughs> <laughs> Montana's wise, some new explosives for the ass I pick up, and I want you to collect it. <laughs> if I'm about, if I'm about to offend half of a, of the United States, I do apologize. But this is great fun. I mean, look at it! Look at the guy's face! There's even a picture of Elvis down there on the side! For the love of God! I have sat and I have thought and considered for ages what and how to do his voice. It was only ever gonna be an Elvis impersonation and God rest his soul. I'm not the best at impersonating it, obviously. I'm not a professional voice actor. You know, but we try. Rap boy James hold his crusty ass out bowling. Park his rig pickup by the trailer. We can test the explosives. It's kind of a, a mix between, you know, of what I remotely remember him sounding like and, uh, you know, some weird southern hybrid accent. But, uh, you know, if you actually speak to him, you know, if, uh, speak to him or can't now, but you know, you hear him speak, you know, normally, he doesn't sound that different from sort of you and I. Arm the triggers with your, uh, arm the triggers, arm the explosive with your trigger finger rooster. Don't hang around. Let's get the hell out of here. Whoa, big explosion. And the explosion is so big, it's killed so many rednecks, they actually hate me. Oh, snap. And the police are not happy with me either. That's bad. Um, but yeah, for something I might as well explain while the, heat, the cop just gets run over, please don't notice me. Um, is that uh, all the gangs obviously know same systems that hate each other? The uh, the Zybots who hate the rednecks, who hate the scientists, who hate the Zybots who. Just so you know, the Zybots are barricade the key gang access point to their territory. Get rid of the barricade could be helpful in the future. Does he? Do you think he sounds like that? I really don't know. I don't know what you make of that, folks. I mean, I've sat for a while as to how to go about that, folks. That is my guess, and, you know, 
I said, I'm not a master at this. Whoa, they're not happy with me. Problems with the rednecks is when they're on the streets, there are loads of them on the streets. Really, really loads of them. The thing you find actually as well in this level, folks, there are gang members all over the joint um, in the uh, in the uh, the map here. So be really careful of that. Right. So we need to take this and go all the way down here to this little barricade. You see Zed Village. Uh oh. I had to do that. Um, Brooks, blow your trigger finger, booster. That was actually quite bad. She's gonna blow. Whoa! That's a lot of explosions. <laughs> Christ! It puts the loonies to shame. Yeehaw, then that boss don't know what hit him. Here's thirty thousand dollars. Keep this up, and you can end up one of those good old boys. There's always a plenty of work for them, Rooster, and I'm slowly losing it. Never mind. Yeah, we've made a mess, folks. <laughs> now, um, just uh, uh, so you know, um, if you look at your map here, just going to quickly uh, check here, just so you know. You might be wondering, you know, why I've been saying why to do the rednecks first. And this is actually one of the reasons. If you look at uh, the your, um, your map, and you look at sort of the, the bottom left of the sort of the Zybot suit, um, sort of, uh, Zaibotsu. Um. What are they shooting that for? What the hell are they shooting him for? What the hell is going on? Yeah. Good God. But if you look at the bottom left of the Zaibotsu ter 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 territory, sort of south of Xenaton, you might notice there's like a big sort of road that sort of um, curves around a little bit. And that is this little um, road we've just opened up here, folks. Um, and it will loops all the way around, all over the redneck territory, like literally above a big massive bridge, and goes all the way to the Zaibotsu village. Um, so you might want to remember that's there, folks, um, because it is a very handy little bridge. Now, need to get the... Uh, Rednecks to like a little bit because, of course, uh, a lot of them died during the course of that mission. So we need to kill a few to make the scientists like us a bit, so we can then kill some of them and then <clears throat> get the rednecks to like us. Because um, you have to be really conscious about making people really angry here. You know, before they start throwing out the really nasty weapons. And honestly, folks, it comes as a shock. And ooh, something. Yoink. So, yeah, so we kill a few Zybots. Don't, I really don't want to try and avoid get gangs hating me. I do want to try and avoid that. Um, uh, here's the uh, the scientist. We've already known the Zybots. Here's the scientist and the sort of a uh, beigey, yellowy thing. Uh, or sort of whatever they are. So we kill a few of them. Just a few. I have to kill one more. Needed to get that up to two, folks. That was necessary. In fact, I might as well kill one more while I'm here. Right, let's get the hell out of here. You're okay, sort of, at this point, just having slightly hate you, because I still use pistols. It's once you get up to the, um... Uh, once you get up to three bars, I believe it is. No. Once you get up to four bars, see if three or four bars that they start bringing out the special special sort of weaponry. Yeah, you've got three tiers for each gang. As far as when they hate you, as to what, you know, how, what kind of weaponry they use. As far as them hating them and liking you, uh, tier one is sort of the lowest one. It's always pistols, but it's the second and third tiers which really vary and are really dangerous. Some more than others, especially the scientists. They are really dangerous. It is scarily dangerous. Right, so back to the mobile RV park. Ah, oh, I gotta stop doing that. Gotta stop doing that, folks. Not helping. <laughs> hey, Rooster, Bella Barbane here. <laughs> I'm real pissed with this I bought to, and that's the rest troubling us. So I want you to go make them trouble each other. Go steal as I bought to Z type. Alright, well, let's, um. Well, go find us the Z type trees. Obviously, we need to go to Zaibatsu territory. Something I'll just uh, also let you know on, folks. Um, you know, something else I, I kind of like is that you do find there's a few places where you can get gangs to fight each other, especially rednecks and Zaibatsu. They can always be fighting each other. Like here, you've got this little square here in um, wherever the hell we are, folks. I don't actually know. 
But you've got the, uh, yeah, the Plaza de Panique, or the, well, you can translate that roughly. And both Zaibotsu and Rednecks can spawn here, folks. Uh, oh, whoops. And they will frequently try to kill each other. Well, I say frequently try to kill each other, they will always try to kill each other, folks. Um, so bear that in mind, folks, that that's there, because, you know, an interesting little place. Ooh, get frenzy. We'll have a crack at that, why not? Oh, this could end badly. Use the Electro Gun to fight 20 people in 120 seconds. Now, Electro Gun is a funnily, uh, funny way of use weapons, folks. It... Yeah. Electrocutes people. Pretty cool. But it electrocutes people. Oh, God. I thought the scientists are liking this a bit. Now, as you see, now we've got up to four stars of them. They'll start using this weaponry. Now, this is a new weapon. I'm just going to save stage just to show this off a bit better. If I've got the right state, which I do now, I think. Um, is this. The dual pistol. Um, pretty handy for taking out vehicles. But, of course, as you can see, slight design flaw almost. In which they can't do much at this point, uh, really. They, they just shoot past you. Not great. And they're easy enough to deal with. Now, I would wish there's a few more pedestrians on the street. But not at the moment, which is quite worrying because I'm about to hit maximum hate with the Zaibotsu, which is bad. Which is very, very bad. Well, I'll tell you what. We'll grab the Z-type. No, go away. Oh, boy. Because when they get to maximum... They will start using submachine guns. Very bad. Very bad. Be very afraid, folks. Because it is really bad. And now I don't want to get in a fight with any Zaibotsu. Because they're going to do that. I'm having to use cars for cover. It's crazy. Oh my god. I nearly died! I've never had to do this before in using cars as cover! This is... Oh, Jesus! I don't want to be here anymore! Just let me go! I'll kill a redneck if I must. Ooh, that was bad! And the result is not great! The Zaibotsu want us dead! Oh my god, that did not go well. <laughs> and we still need a Z-Type. Oh, Jesus. Let's go find a Z-Type, folks, before we end up getting murdered here. But this is the real danger of later levels, folks. Now they start using this sort of special sort of weaponry. It makes things really tricky. You know, really, really tricky, folks. And it's just gotta take so much care. Have we gone too far now? Uh, Arbo, yeah, that's too far, folks. We need to go back north. Find our Z car. And I don't want to go into the Zaibotsu village because it is a haven for these guys. That will do quite nicely. Thank you. Right on. Drive all the SRS area and start killing signs. I'd say that 100% right. Um, it, it, it's a bit too touch and go with this, uh, I'll be honest, folks. A bit touch and go. Alright, so we head all the way down here. Oh, I just left the building again! <laughs> Can I hear what you had to say? Or you're not going to say anything? Oh, the SRS are even helping me. Basically, yeah, we need to go and, um, well, we now start killing, uh, Z uh scientists now. Kill 20 of them, they say. Now, this is obviously a lot easier at this point because we've actually ended up accidentally getting them scientists to really like us, folks. Um, which, well, works out quite nicely. So, let's go mow down 20 scientists. Oh, it's a bit of a weird one, though. What, why on earth do you know, it's just, if these guys are scientists, why are they walking around with guns? I mean, that's some weird kind of science, folks. 
Well, I, I know, I know the reason why, or at least what's hinted is the reason why they apparently carry around so many guns, folks. Then we'll figure that one out a little later. Nail them down. Nail them down. Nail them. Nail them. Nail them down. Oh, <coughs> look, get back it. Nearly there. A few more. No, get back here. You did it, Rooster. You did it, Rooster. Now steal an SRS Meteor. Drive into Zaibatsu Village. And that means we get to drive as a Meteor, which makes me very happy because I love this car. It is fast. Sadly, its turning circle is not amazing. Well, it is. It's alright, but it's a bit fiddly. It's a funny one, folks. Now, I'm a bit concerned the Zybotsu despise us. So, this could get interesting. Kill 20 of them, there's Zybotsu with your SRS Meteor, Rooster. Now, luckily, it's only dual pistols for now, but it will not stay that way. Oh my god. Oh, that guy's only using a pistol. Oh, here come the machine guns. Just gotta keep doing this. Do not get stuck, folks. Because then you will die. Because those machine guns will rip you to shreds. Very bad. Oh my god, right. Let's get this uh, resprayed, I think. Might be an idea. Get it repaired. Oh, he won't repair it. That makes things interesting. I don't know if you just heard that, folks. Oh my god. Ah! Stay away from me! I'm scared! Oh god! Jesus! Oh my grief! This is bad! Oh, good god! I'm about to die! I'm highly concerned for my own personal well-being. I want to get out of here! Oh my grief. Get the hell out of here, folks. Well, I don't know about that. For some reason, my, uh... No! I don't want to give you my money! God damn it! Well, that was uh, <laughs> an interesting start to that mission. Um, apart from the fact that we're nearly dead, um, that and the fact that Zaibotsu despise us, that's not gone too badly. What we'll do, folks, we head down here. Somewhere or the other is the um, Zaibotsu yellow phones. Somewhere or the other. Um, so what we can do is we can... Uh, or some phones are here. Someone, somewhere. And we're going to go ahead and use those phones to um, get some health. Because, as you can see, it's not gone to plan. Right. He didn't appreciate me stealing this car. I, it, I've got no choice here. Right. Where the hell is the phone for these? Ah, there's... Oh, there's armor, health, and the rocket launcher does spawn you, folks. You can sit there and get 99 rockets if you so desire. I'm not going to. Because I don't really care for it that much. Whoops. Well, who knows? The police might end up getting involved and might start distracting some of these like, bots here. Not that the police are going to last very long. But anyways, let's mow down some more of these guys. Yeah, just keep using pistols. That's fine by me. Yeah, the nice thing is that they don't all use these special weapons. <coughs> or the new weapons. Some of them do, some of them don't. Or the fact that the police are chasing me is actually made this more handy because they're reluctant to actually get involved and start dealing with the police, which is actually quite handy. Oh no. No. Oh god. I had to get out and kill him so I could try and. try and save the car. Yeehaw! Whoa. We got Zaibatsu killing scientists and scientists killing Zaibatsu. You sure are the man, Rooster. Have 30 grand for your fine work. 
here with a man. Uh, you can see the dramatic effect this has had on our standing with some gangs, folks. Good God. I don't think we're very welcome around the Zaibatsu quarter. I think they despise us. Oh my God, grief. We got time for one more mission, so let's get cracking with, with a yellow here, folks. Why the hell not? Benson Burner. Hey, Roosters, better by Bane here. Cop Chief expecting a shiny new Benson, but he's giving give me a shirt, so I won't surprise him. So, still me a Benson? Still me a Ben? <laughs> Put my teeth back in. Or my tongue, or whatever the hell. Let's go! Let's get my bloody Benson! Um, and we need to get a, a, a one particular Benson, just so you know, folks. So let's go get one. Or get it, or just whatever. Whoops, didn't mean to hit him, but oh well. Yeah, as, as low that at least the, um, the minus sign is not flashing means, uh, that the guy's not gonna, they're not gonna be pulling out, um, submachine guns, at least. Nope, this is the wrong one. It's the next one, isn't it? Yeah, one of them's got, like, uh, stairs. Um, which are quite handy, set of stairs. Whoops. They lead you up to this ma big, massive motorway here. But just so you know. So here we are, busy chasing down a Benson for a cop in a TV van. This is going to take bloody forever, isn't it, folks, really? Christ. Come on! Go faster! Does this bl bloody cop car can certainly go faster? Oh, grief. He's driving around the Zaibotsu zone. Oh, my God. Oh, Christ! Oh, Jesus! They killed themselves to try and get me! Oh, my God. I'm just trying to do it. Just to, that's just purely to distract the police. There's like bots who just get them trying to fight each other. Good God. They despise me. And I end up getting this for my troubles. A blooming whatever this is. This is a rubbish car. Although you can put it into the uh, scrap, um, the uh, car crushery thing, and you will actually get um, grenades for it, which isn't so bad. Um, don't we come across grenades yet? Don't think we have, folks. Um, it acts just like a Molotov does, except it bounces a bit and doesn't detonate straight away, basically. It's not bad. Oh my god, how long can it take to get to a Benson? Look at all the rednecks though, this is the, one of the advantages of having people like you. Because there's so many gang members on the street, they will just go and defend you in mass. It's amazing. We're not far from it here. <laughs> While the, the police keep nailing pedestrians. Oh, that's not gone well. Damn, we have to proceed on foot here. Oh, they just we're just after this damn Benson. I'm not taking a hot dog van. No. And not another van. Just give me a car. And of course the sports car appears at the top. Thank you. I'll be borrowing that. Cheers. Alright, let's hunt down this blooming Benson wherever the hell it has ended up now. Cause I, we're chasing off, we just can't seem to find it. More shadow chasing. Ah, uh, it might help if I get on the the side of the street that I need to while nearly getting arrested. I had to get out because if he had pulled me out, that would have been it. Arrested. All over. I just... Ow. So much for trying to get into that vehicle. Go forward! Yeah, you haven't even baby haven't even started this damn mission yet. We haven't even got done the first objective and it's taken us about five minutes. 
I thought we'd have plenty of time to do this level, this mission, but we're going to... Yeah, we're overrunning now, probably. I, what are we overrunning? Yeah, we're probably just coming up to 30. Yeah, I'm doing these, um, like I said, in uh, the Kirby's adventure. These um, videos are going to be 30 minutes for now, because um, at this rate I'm sort of uploading one, a, one video a day. Um, and, I, you know, I was only doing 20 minutes for... Well, I was doing 20 minutes for a lot of things, because I sort of had, uh, for a time I was uploading two videos a day... Um, yeah, which is 40 minutes, but 20 minutes just doesn't really feel like enough. So I figured I'd um, put them to half-hour videos, and uh, well, there's our Benson. Can we get it without being arrested? We can. Montana's got the explosive ready at the trailer park, but he needs five grand. Now you kill the cash, you need to, Rooster. What the hell? Johnny Zoo gave us some money. He gave us money, like, twice during a mission, and you're not going to give me five grand? That's not very nice, um, Billy Bob Bane. <laughs> I love saying that. Praise the Lord, Rooster. Take this here Benson, the Buckwheat's crane, and await the sign! Why is, why is he exclaiming the word sign? I don't know, folks. I wish I did. <clears throat> but I don't know. Anyways, off to Buckwheat, apparently. Um, be nice if there was some more uh, rednecks who would be happily defending me. Why are these rednecks here? Thank you. Oh, God's sakes. White T has the trailer. Find a truck air Brewster. We got ourselves transportation for the Benson. Or oh, you can keep getting the... Nope. Surrounded and attacked by more police. Oh my god, the rednecks are just going to war for me. Now, this is a really nice feature they added into um, Graft Auto 2. Uh, featured a lot more prominently, say, in a game like uh, Graft Auto San Andreas. But you can get hold of a truck cab. Um, now, let's go get Dwight T's trailer. And if you can get a truck cab, folks, you can actually. Um, you can actually, what's the word I'm looking for here, uh, you, well yeah, you can actually um, get hold of trailers and actually, nope, drive them, follow them, don't want to go to the old banjo, um, because that's just a dead end, a confusing and long dead end, but a dead end. You want to come through this road, yeah, and you see here, trailer, now if you back up uh, one of these truck cabs, You can actually get hold of the trailer. How cool is that? Drive the trailer over the Buckwheat's train, Rooster. Get that Benson there. Get that there Benson loaded. So what we can do here, uh, be got to be careful though when you're driving the trailer because it's a fiddly vehicle to... Because it's on a pivot means you can't reverse properly and it's very long and a bit fiddly. So you got to be careful how you drive. You've got to be a bit cautious to be honest. Park the trailer and the bunk we dump his load. Eww, he's dumping his load. Deliver this Benson safe, Rooster. And I might just give you a shot at my Mary Jo Bean. Yeah, Mary Jo Bean. Um, oh, I hate this disgrace, lads. I always come down here. It's a dead end. Yeah, his, um, wife, I would... Well, it must be his wife, Mary Jo. As, uh, along with Billy Bob. My head is be- I'm shaking my head in utter bemusement and slight shock. Crazy. Anyways, so let's go past these. Yeah, one thing also as well with the trailer and the truck cab folks, they actually have their own sort of if you can imagine the sort of health bars or map health they have till they blow up, they're actually separate. Um, if one blows up, the other blows up. But they actually have their own separate health, so keep that in mind, folks. May come in handy one day. Well, you know, just handy just knowing that. Get out the way. So I'm just listening to this, folks. You end up in a tight spot. You need a credit card that can squeeze you out. For all this.
this and more, I choose Credix Gold. Credix Gold, the premier choice of Irish legend. You heard it. You heard it here, fo first, folks. Credix Gold. It's the only way to go. Apparently. Anyways, we need to take this uh, trailer into um, that big, massive building on the right there, which is, uh, well, it's well. I'm pretty sure it is the the uh, police station for this map. Though I have a feeling, is there isn't there two in this map or something? Or is like a there's like a well, you've got a few things actually. If you look at your uh, map, folks, you look at the very bottom there. There is actually a prison in this map. Um, so uh, that's pretty kind of that's kind of cool. Sadly, getting into it's not very easy, but um, that's not a huge problem, right? Get in here, and we'll drop off the Benton. Leave the trailer near the car crane. Trailer ain't gonna drive itself. It oh, fine, I'll get inside. Let's see Montana's fireworks roast this pig. Squeal, little pig, little piggy. And there's Montana. Oh, baby, my new Benson. Rolling hills, here we come. Here's fifty grand. Thank you. Come again. And voila! He gave us fifty grand for the Benson. How nice of him. Um, uh, rolling hills here we come. I don't think he's gonna be risking any more rolling hills. He might be risking a lot of daisies that he's gonna be pushing up. Um, but uh, no rolling hills for him, sadly. Uh, which the scientists don't approve of much, but that's probably just the science territory. But anyways, but yeah, you'll notice, folks, as we go through, you'll notice there's a lot of different tracks now, and obviously, it's with the different radio stations. Some music will come up um, here, there, and everywhere, but some tracks have their own tracks, and that, which is kind of cool. I mean, you've got some that will repeat, like something like um, Head, um, Head Radio, Head F, or Head FM, or whatever the hell it's called in this game. I forget. But there's a few that will come up, and they have their own sort of songs that you probably haven't heard yet and they're pretty cool actually some of them that's one reason I like this level because there are some pretty good ones anyways folks um, we're going to quit a video because we have really overrun quite badly in the next video uh, we're going to be uh, carrying on doing some work for uh, Billy Bob Bane here um, so yeah so I'll see you in the next video